girls and daughters are not a burden to the nation but they are the pride of the family pride of the nation and pride of the world i just want to give one message to the women across the world that you know a lot of us suffer in silence unheard unnoticed and unanswered women dear women failures and difficulties don't come to destroy you but they come to let you realize your hidden inner potential let difficulties know that you too are difficult voice your opinions speak out and seek help i i i'm talking to the general public also who is seeing me there but seek seek help from these wonderful she teams who are here who are working day in and day out to ensure your safety because your voice has the power to change the generation and believe in yourself and there's nothing that you can't achieve stand up for yourself stand up for your dignity and stand up for self respect teach your children to idealize these real heroes and not just the real heroes india is a young country with a lots of hope laid on its youth while half of the youngsters are doing extremely well you know especially during the pandemic we must have seen youngsters coming up with unique ideas and you know apps and technologies while half of the youth is busy doing this the other half of the youth is busy just browsing the social media just interested into the personal life of celebrities or just burning their parents money for the sake of you know gaming or even cyberbullying i think it's okay to socialize but it is important that we channelize our energies in the right direction and we utilize our time and opportunities to the best possible extent youth have to become job creators from job seekers for which five c's would definitely help us competence courage confidence communication skills and consistency sir i know you have done a wonderful job by organizing a job mail our 8000 women have joined in it uh, i stay close to usmania university and it happened there and even i happened to inform few of my friends to take part in that so when you have when you develop the competence and the skill i think nobody could actually say no to you and even if you have the skill if you don't have the courage and confidence to present yourself i think the skill won't be put to use and after, even though you have your courage and confidence if you can't communicate well it is extremely important to have good oral and written communication skills if you cannot communicate well and speak out your heart it will not take us places and it is and finally it is important to stay consistent you guys are, are the best example for consistency and discipline and to all the youth this is extremely important to learn from you all and uh, i think our parents i mean for us at least youngsters parents have been working day in and day out just to ensure to give us a good living and keep our tummy full so we need to remember the values the parents and teachers have inculcated in us and ask ourselves what do i want to be how do i contribute to my nation to my parents and myself you need not be an achiever achiever or not does not matter but it is extremely important that be that we be good citizens of our nation because a lots of people around you surrounding you are noticing you so we need to make sure that our life is inspiring and i am blessed as you as you have seen in the video i am i feel blessed to have been appreciated by dr apj abdul kalam sir and at this juncture i'd like to uh, quote one of his uh, quotes where there is righteousness in the heart there is beauty in the character where there is beauty in the character there's harmony in the home where there is harmony in the home there's order in the nation and when there is order in the nation there is peace in the world this is extremely important for us to remember i think if we youth around if we can follow this simple ideology you know and if we can give peace and if we can maintain that peace and order in our nation i think you know these hard working police officers who are de dealing with criminal cases day in and day out will get some little extra time to spend with their family it is which is so important <laughs> i completely understand how sacrificing you all are you're sacrificing your own family time for the sake of all of us for the sake of us so 
For youth, I think it's important that we maintain this peace and order. And dear officers, as a doctor and yoga practitioner, I would like to highlight on the importance that amidst all the roles you play, do not overlook your health. Make sure that you value your physical, mental and emotional health because you all are extremely, extremely and extremely precious to us. You make us live safe. And uh, like all of us, uh, you know, a lot of us have chalans against our vehicles. So just like how we clear our chalans, I think we all have a long pending due and chalans against a girl child. It is now that we pay back the, the dues that we give to a girl child, which is the respect and the honor that she deserves. Give her the wings and let her fly. Yatranarias tu pujyante, ramante tatra devata. Girls and daughters are not a burden to the nation, but they are the pride of the family, pride of the nation, and pride of the world. Dear change makers, let us celebrate this remarkable achievement of ours and proudly say that I am being the change that I want to see in the world. Can I request you to repeat after me? I am proud of myself that I am being the change that I want to see in the world. Thank you so much. This is an extremely wonderful opportunity that you have given me. I feel so blessed to be standing here in front of you. Thank you so much. Thank you.